Hi guys, this is Jimmy from Kes Group and in this short demo we're going to take a quick look at one of the new features in V-Ray 2.0. As you can see, I've already opened my scene and rendered it out in order to save some time. And this scene took one minute to render. As you can see we have a very straightforward setup. We have several reflective objects and a very bright uh, light source in the scene. And the image looks pretty good but um, in fact, if I had taken this picture with an actual uh, camera, I would have some boom and glare effects around those bright spots. And in V-Ray 2.0, I can very easily add those by going to into the Environments and Effect uh, menu and adding a new V-Ray Lens effect. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to enable the boom and click on the Update effect. And you will immediately see the effect that this uh, creates. So we now have some boom around the bright spots. And I can actually increase the size of that boom effect and update the effect right away. Or I can uh, play with the weight as well. And the cool thing is that uh, these effects are added as a post effect. And we can immediately uh, see the result. We don't have to render everything all over again. Now I'm going to turn off the boom and enable the glare. And again, I'm going to update the effect. And you can see that now we have the glare effect and we have those rays of light and if we count them you'll see that there are eight. The reason for this is that uh, my physical camera actually has uh, the aperture the aperture has eight sides. So I'll select my camera, go to the modify tab and here in the blades you'll see that we have a number of eight. Uh, what I can do is I can also turn on the diffraction and maybe increase this weight a little bit and the size a little bit and update the effect once again. And if I zoom out, zoom in, you'll be able to see the actual diffraction of light. So as you can see, with the very uh, lens effects, it's pretty easy uh, to add those lens effects and glare and boom effects. And um, everything happens as a post effect, so you have much more control over the way your final image looks like. So this concludes this uh, short demo. I'm Dimitar Krstev Jimmy, and I thank you for watching.